space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of the Starship Enterprise. Its continuing mission to explore strange new worlds. To seek out new life. To boldly go where no one has gone before. <laughs> Alright, so today we are going to play this game, Breathe Edge. I believe it was in early access. I'm not 100% sure. I, I seen it for a while. I never bought it, but it got released the other day. And it's like a space subnautica type game, which is cool because that's what I want real bad. I want a space space game our boy looks a little bit like us and we're just gonna start this game i got a bunch of games that i'm gonna start uploading soon where it's like episode one of this episode one of that uh that doesn't mean i'm leaving the other games behind it just means that i'm getting out the beginnings of everything that i will play so let's go space game yeah, walk. What is happening? Walking my toes with crutches. I'm in a robot jail. Get me out of this. Marshmallow heads. What the heck? It's like New Vegas. It's the beginning of New Vegas. The Red Ruin Software's team is categorically against smoking, which causes. No, let them smoke. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> which causes loud headlines in newspapers and other diseases. And therefore, we suggest that you replace this dangerous cigarettes in the robot's claws for something more useful. Nah, let him smoke. Did you have time to think of how to behave during the interrogation? Remind him, R2-D3. R2-D3? Ugh! Oh! Put on a defiant expression and spit on his face. This is what you get, Toaster Man. He got a windshield wiper for a penis? I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Spit again. <laughs> Interstellar liner. Unnamed. Or yogurt. Is that what it said? <laughs> Not named or it's called yogurt. The yogurt ship. Oh, is that? Oh, I thought that was me. Oh, it's my dad. Oh, Papa. What? <laughs> Papa. Green universe broccoli attack. Oh, I want to read this. No. Oh my God, Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cannoli. It's me. Is that gum? Yeah, get that gum off my body. I got a rooster! Greetings. I'm your funerary spacesuit's built-in guide to the world of space funerals. Before we start communicating further, confirm that you are still able to read after the impact. Uh, able to what? Confirm that you're still... Wait, confirm you are still able to read after the impact. How do I confirm? Just yes. Splendid. You've gotten into a non-standard situation. The Breath Edge Global Funeral Agency is proud of its impeccable history. However, your death may cause the loss of its reputation. Therefore, we suggest that you stop the gas leak and survive. Oh, stop the gas leak. Oh, I need the gum. When picking up any useful items, you can stuff them in your pockets, calling it an inventory, if you will. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I stop it with a chicken? What? Oh, my, it's uh, uh. okay, okay, okay. Whoa, the, the, uh, there's no gravity. 
Why am I stopping him with a chicken? I have. <gasps> oh, the chicken's gonna. Leakage. You'll need an object without any holes. Okay, okay, okay. An object without any holes. What about the chewing gum? Shears required. I need shears to cut that. All right, let's do this. Uh, I tap Take out the chewing gum from your pocket. Yep. Try not to get your feet stick it somewhere except for your face. You deserve some words of encouragement. I That's did it. Impressive. You've almost won. Root the spacesuit or become depressed. Okay, okay, okay. Become depressed. I got that. I could easily do it. Find the interphone or get depressed. Oh, I'm so sad. My daily life is horrific. Is this my papa photo? Oh, Grandpa. One of the last photos of Grandpa, who didn't part with the chicken until his death. He really liked himself here, and I couldn't help putting his photo into a frame. Uh, here it is. Interphone. Just the antenna. You'll have to go into <laughs> outer space. What? I don't want to go to the outer space. Where am I supposed to go? Is it that? Oh my gosh, this is nuts. I'm in space! What do I do? What's which way's up? Which way's down? That was a close call. Try to adjust the antenna very carefully. You've got great engineering skills. You have broken the antenna completely. Now you will need some special equipment and interphone activation codes which are encrypted in the memory of the steering wheel if it's still intact. Okay, okay, I've fucked up the antenna. Let's get back in our spaceship. Yo, this is nuts. Look at all my grandpa photos. Okay, so the fists are my tasks. I get it. Now that I figured that out. Huh. It looks like the steering wheel. You need to try to connect to it. The steering wheel connects to it? Great huh. news. Using my ingenious two-digit password matching algorithm, I managed to hack the interphone activation codes. Now all that's left is to build a cryptographic debugging station and reconfigure the interphone using these codes, which will take about five years with your current skills. Hell yeah, dude. Whatever you said. Remember this... that you are still able to become depressed. <laughs> I'm always depressed. That never leaves me. We're going to go outside and collect metals. Is this a metal? I need a handy scrapper. What is this? Tape recorder. I need a, another handy scrapper. Alright, we gotta go find a handy handy dandy hoot nanny. Oh, look at my... Am I just naked? No, I'm wearing a spacesuit. I'm a spacesuit wearing a spacesuit. I swear I thought this blue thing was my hand. <laughs> it's not. That's funny. Back scratcher. I got a new blueprint. A grabber. Take the rubber. Take the fabric. <laughs> Is that me scratching my back? <laughs> Debugging station. I need two, two metals and a wire. So I wonder if... There's just... Floating. Oh, what is this? Oh. Oh my god, I'm at 41 breathability. Uh, let's get this scrap, whatever that is. Found a piece of metal. Okay. The tiny pieces we could get for now. My boy gotta go find a wire. It's been a while. Man, dude, I lose my breath real quick. We gotta find these wires. Where are wires? Radio, I can't break that yet. Metal. A box, another radio. We're just floating through the atmosphere, dude. Toilet detected. Some of our clients are very sensitive about toilet talk, and therefore we included a dictionary filter which will replace the word feces with the word joy. <laughs> There's a poo-poo station. What is this? I got it. I got a wire. Let's get home. It's like the movie Gravity. What was that bitch's name in it? It's not Hillary Swank. <laughs> Hillary Swank in space. The other chick. Julia Roberts or something like that. One of those bitches with a big mouth. Cryptographic debugging station. 
pick up the debugging station. If you're sure that this is exactly what was on the blueprint, then try to reconfigure the receiver. If you have any doubts concerning it, then you will eventually suffer an electric shock, and then your spacesuit will automatically take your body measurements to order a coffin from our company. Thank you for choosing the Global Funeral Agency. <laughs> uh, okay. I gotta go do the DD. Doo -doo. I gotta debug the receiver. <laughs> I did it! I debugged it! You need to get to the extraction point yourself, getting past the radiation. However, it's impossible to do this with your current skills. To increase your level, you need to create some crap imposed by the developers. <laughs> Alright, I need to create the crap imposed by the developers. Deve developers of the game? Imbued crap to my hands. How do I do that? Create the crap imposed by the developers. Three metals for that. A grabber and a drill. Okay, we need three metal. I have two metal. Let's go find metal. Babe! Incredible! Survived one! I see your avatar online! Whoa! Look at him titties, girl! Where... It wasn't possible to determine the coordinates of the survivor. Communication only works on reception, which gives a good reason not to respond and not to be distracted, despite the objections of the hormonal system. I'm distracted. Come on, girl. Where are you at? How do I call her? Let me call her. No! I'm space horny, dude. I have big bust and slender legs. I wanted you to know and motivate to save me. <laughs> I'm trying, girl. I'm coming. Where are you? <laughs> I'm on my way. That's all I needed to hear. It's my chicken picture. All photo albums at home are filled with pictures of the chicken. A portrait with a dark background. A portrait with a light background. A master shot in the rain. Dude, you gotta get your chicken pictures. Call 